Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Resto Rob. Today we're going to do uh we're going to cover another tool haul. Unfortunately, it's too cold outside, too much snow to get out to my shop and really do anything. So, I'm kind of laying off on some restorations right now until the snow melts and it warms up a little bit. But let's take a look at some of uh the tools that I picked up. So, sit back, relax and see what I got. We're going to take a look at the inside of these. Here is a quick tool haul of a toolbox that we just picked up. So we're going to take a look at what's inside. Got some cheap uh, Allen keys. Here's a task force. Another task force. Here's a Craftsman three-quarter, half-inch drive, a no-name cheap socket, we got some drill bits, and little tiny bits here, some drill bits. Metrich socket. Oh no, task force. Probably I'm assuming this is task force as well. Another cheap E, got a sanding block. Damaged saw blade. little file more Allen keys more saw blade uh, craftsman 10 millimeter some more little bits A cheap um, scraper, no blade. Here we have a Husky USA seven six Husky USA seven sixteenths um, impact socket. More bits. Metrich Task Force Metrich A pen Um What is this? Wear safety glasses Stanley Um Punch Little tiny, oh, Craftsman screwdriver. Cracked. And another task force. More bits. Um, little mat wrench. Um, task force. Little stainless steel tool. Here we've got a DeWalt multi saw. Little holder for bits. A 
pair of gloves. Okay. This could be an S Wing. Not seeing the name on it. S Wing. So we got a leather S Wing hammer. Um, pair of rusty pin snips. Chrome Vanadium Taiwan screwdriver. A bent screwdriver. A fuller channel adjustment pliers. A fencing plier. Made in the USA flat blade. Ooh, the uh, brand new real tree visor clip for your sunglasses. Probably for your truck visor. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, this Black and Decker. How the hell does this work? Adjustable wrench. What the? I have no idea. Anybody ever seen one of these things before? Oh, I bet she's got a motor to do that. And yeah, we'll see if we can't put a battery in. This is a 430 channel lock. A delicious smelling screwdriver. Ooh, an easy holder. In Felipe. I know who's getting this. This Globemaster. Too bad they damaged the tips, because that's kind of cute. We've got a much. I'll have to clean up this, figure out what that brand is. But these will clean up. Korea. Got a PM um, screwdriver. Pair of uh, slip joint pliers. An Ace Hardware bent screwdriver. Wood handle stubby screwdriver, Taiwan. Here is just plain Jane piece of junk screwdriver. What was a Craftsman screwdriver? Another plain Jane. Taiwan pruning shears. Chrome vanadium. Here's Master Wrench, Chrome Vanadium, Task Force, Nothing, Sockets, 
MSK 9 sixteenths. More task force. Tiny duck bill. Probably Taiwan. Got a uh, a Vaco bull driver flat blade. Um, probably a Stanley. And last but not least, another quarter inch drive bit. So, we got some good stuff out of here and some not so good stuff. And we've got the official Chuck Fan Club Magnet. I'll put it on one of the toolboxes. But thank you, Mag Dad, for the Bonnie alligator wrench. Um, everybody probably saw in Mag Dad's video where the tip was broken, but we can uh, clean that up with the. We can sand that up and make it look normal. But uh, appreciate the Bonnie. Trying to look through my phone. Okay, here we go. Bonnie USA. So thank you. Okay, and then this is another little bin of different things that I got from the auction as well. We got these little shoemaker feet. Fortunately, that's damaged, but uh, little tiny foot thing. I don't know what does what do you call these cobbling tools. Anybody know anything about these? Um, we've got this grommet. I want to say it's a grommet made in Taiwan tool. Here's a patent. Drill Minder Plus. Oh, you spin it around and you can get bits and whatnot out of it. Okay. Here's a num part number on it. Probably from Granger, I don't know. We've got an S-Wing hooligan tool. Pry bar. One of these uh, plumbing tools. Um, I like to use these because I can clean up tools and these are rubber br or metal brushes, sockets and whatnot. A Utica pair of slip joints. That's not bad. In this we got the SK. Half inch drive with the SK thirteen sixteenths. Twist drill set. With a couple masonry bits. Some straight line chalk. Gasket maker. A 
here is a Taiwan vice grip here is an Irwin vice grip got another vice grip Irwin the original made in the USA um, pair of Klaus Fremont Ohio um, tin snips a 420 pair of pliers channel lock We'll have to move all these up a little bit. Clean some of the rust off. Um, I'm going to say this is a baby channel lock. By the color, but you never know. What's this? A no name Phillips. Here's a Craftsman Phillips. And a no name Torx bit. Here's one of those fancy oh, gear wrench star drive extension things and last but not least high strength per permanex thread thread stop so this is my uh, latest and greatest tool haul Well, everybody, hopefully you enjoyed that tool haul of uh, some of the stuff I got. And what do you think? Leave a comment below. I'm running through the numbers. For the whole lot, I ended up paying $18 for everything. So let me know if you think that was too high or too low. And let me know what you liked about that stuff. Um, I'm going to share a link to one of my favorite... Uh, sites I like to go to for auctions um, first thing is all these sites can be found on hybrid hybrid I'll share a link to hybrid um, and you can type in and see if you can find online auctions in your area nobody's paying me for any of this or anything but uh, I'm gonna share with you my favorite uh, MTC uh, Michigan Trading Company um, to all the people working there, thank you so much for all, all that you guys do. You guys work really hard, work your asses off, and always looking for crap to sell to Rob. So uh, I'll share a link to their, uh, their website as well if you're in the Michigan area. I hate for you guys to compete against me, but they got to make money too, and they offer a lot of really cool cool things more than just tools they have a variety of everything so take a look at what everybody has and um as always stay safe oh, please like subscribe follow me on instagram at robert j faust um my instagram links can be found below and for everybody out there stay safe and um check you later check you later check you later who says that check you later